One flew over the Loud House? Oh my god, this episode from the Loud House sucks. Here are the reasons why this episode sucks in my opinion. The episode starts while Lincoln wakes up late on a Saturday morning, and is surprised to hear nothing at all. He walks out of his room to find that the upstairs hallway is a wreck. He sees Lana and Lola come out of their room looking sick, and he tries to back away, only to find a sick Lori and Lynn. He continues to back away, only to be pulled into Lisa's room. He finds Lini, Luna, Luan, Lucy, and Lisa, who take his temperature to make sure he isn't sick. When they know he isn't sick, they explain what happened. Lori got the flu and sneezed on Lynn's basketball, causing her to get infected. Lynn went and drank orange juice from the carton so when Lana drank the juice, she got infected due to the germs Lynn had previously released into the carton. Lana coughed on Lola, causing her to get infected, and the rest were taking shelter in Lisa's room to avoid the disease. Lincoln calls Clyde and tells him the flu is invading the house. Clyde mourns when he hears Lori got the flu. Lincoln lets Clyde know six of them are fine, only for Luan to sneeze. They assume Luan is infected. When she says she's not, pun intended, she becomes a zombie and they throw her out of the room. Lincoln says they need to leave the house, but Lini says that they should help their family. Everyone sides with Lincoln and grabs a gun filled with chicken soup, except for Lini who believes that they should take care of the ones who have the flu. They leave and before they make it downstairs, Luna gets cornered and eventually infected. They make it downstairs, knowing Luna got infected and thinking Lucy also got infected. They try to leave through the front door, but the pets are outside and infected. They try the back door, but find more infected siblings. They head to mom and dad's room and find them infected, but they also find that Lucy wasn't infected. Lincoln tries contacting Clyde but his walkie-talkie is dead. They sneak into Lisa's room for batteries and see Lily is infected too. Lily sends a snot bubble at them, but it misses and it goes out the window. They recharge the walkie-talkie and make it to the kitchen. When Lincoln attempts to open the door, the snot bubble flies in through an open window and infects Lucy who infects both the doorknob and Lisa. Lini says she's going to stay behind and help the others, allowing Lincoln to escape. Unfortunately, Luna is about to sneeze on Lini but Lincoln jumps in front of her and gets himself infected. He says Lini deserved to be healthy more than he did, only to end up sneezing on her, thus infecting the last healthy person and everybody in the house. Now that every member of the Loud family is sick, Clyde, wearing a hazmat suit, brings his food into the living room, which the Ludes quickly devour as the episode ends. And that's how the episode goes. If you haven't seen it, don't watch it. It's a waste of time. I don't know who like or hates this episode, so I'm gonna leave it be. So screw one flew over the loud house. And screw stall monitor. Coop Dreams is 789,000 times better than one flew over the loud house. End of rant. Well, that's the end of season 6, the final of 2020. Season 7 will be on January 7, 2021. Anyways, this is Peter Pukka is Brazil Kid vs. Cat is North Korea. Peace out. And by the way, Happy New Year.